can you please explain to our beautiful crowd what is it that you do at the American Truth Project and who you are? Happy to do it, Jermaine. American Truth Project, as uh, your regular viewers know, is a 501c3 uh, nonprofit, which means uh, people can donate and write it off on their taxes because we are an educational foundation. That's what we do. Now, what do we educate on? American security. And we do it uh, going through five general uh, issues that are the most acute in terms of how they affect the security of America. We deal with uh, Islamic terror around the world, largely in the Middle East. We deal with homegrown terror and national security, including sanctity and preservation of our borders. We talk about Middle Eastern policy of the United States, our foreign policy. Uh, we talk about the relationship with our closest and most strategic ally around the world, which is the state of Israel, the front line in the war against terror. And finally, uh, sadly, we have included uh, the boycott, divestment, and sanctions, or BDS movement, as it's exploded across America and the anti-Semitism that movement has brought now, even, believe it or not, as we're going to talk about today, Jermaine, to the United States Congress. So anybody that wants to get our stuff can go to American Truth Project. The easiest way to do it is just type in find Barry dot com find Barry dot com that's me takes you right to the site you can sign up for free we never charge for content and you'll see five six seven hundred shows there uh, our content comes out every uh, every other day or so and uh, we post our wonderful shows with Jermaine there as well if you want to catch uh, segments here and there for everyone that's a Jermaine Bazio uh, conservative nation guest if you go to our website, findberry.com, you can get the first two chapters of my new book because you asked for free. Uh, actually, now I think it's three chapters you can get. Just put in your email and you'll get it in your inbox in about 30 seconds. Start reading and then write and let me know what you think.